Hi guys, welcome to my apartment. So this is my apartment in California. It is double the size of the one that we were living in in New York. It is a two bed, two bath. And when we first moved here, we realized there was just so much space compared to our 550 square feet apartment in New York. If you guys saw that apartment tour, you realized what a big difference it is. This is the hallway section. We have a little council over here for our keys and bag and just decorations. And right in here, we have our laundry room. Washer, dryer in unit, which is insane from a New Yorker because if you don't know, in New York, you never have a washer dryer in unit unless you're paying a lot. I feel like having a washer dryer makes you lazier because we just tend to not fold our things afterwards and just leave it, which is why we have the basket over here. Some of Kobe's extra food, a hamper, and just some cleaning supplies as well. Okay, so on the other side of the hallway, we have this closet. And this is a pretty big closet. I keep the winter coats, the jackets, the shoes in here. Pretty much all our shoes go in here. Up here, there's not a lot of storage. That's why we have all of the coats hung, even though we don't use most of it because it doesn't get that cold. We have a little storage over here. This is the snack and um, dry food pantry. Usually we have a lot more snacks, but we actually just cleaned that out. And then down here, we just keep some extra like garbage bags and things like that. Um, but honestly, this apartment has a lot of storage, which is really nice. All right, the first piece of furniture is this little table. This is our little dining table setup. It's obviously a really small just for two people and it's funny because this is the only piece of furniture that we brought from New York and it's literally just like a $30 Ikea table. But what's nice about this table is that it actually comes out and you can see like two more people and if we have guests over, it's really nice for that. These dining chairs are from Dania's Furniture. It's my first time shopping from them and I really like these chairs. They're like nice and sturdy and pretty comfortable actually too and this is the open kitchen it's such a big kitchen actually and it's really nice to cook in we have these black countertops which actually get dusty and dirty really easily you wouldn't think black does but these get dusty really easily so we have to clean it like almost every single day over here we have the air fryer which I have been using so much of ever since I got it like a month ago. This is the little coffee nook. We have some Nespresso capsules over here. As you can see, there are so many cabinets, which is really nice because it helps us keep organized. Okay, so moving on to the living space. I love our living space. I think it's probably the best part of the apartment. It's so comfortable and cozy. Apparently, Kobe really loves it here too. He always sunbathes here or outside on the balcony. Okay, we're gonna start off with this mirror. It's about a seven foot mirror and this is from CB2. Apparently Ikea has something really similar, so if you guys are looking for something similar but more affordable, look at Ikea. We have a little bit of pompous grass and it's just a little bit of a decoration. I really like, like the beigey color of it. I have a little end table here, which I put some coffee table books and just like flowers for decorations, but it's nice when I'm like sitting over here i can put my coffee or my tea down so this is the couch i get a lot of questions on this couch it's actually from ikea it's called the harlanda couch and this wasn't even our first option but because of covid like everything was kind of back ordered and we ended up just getting this because it was in stock but i really like it i feel like this couch is like perfect for this space it's just like the right size 
So next we have our coffee table. This is from Article. I really like it. I was looking for a circular round coffee table for a while and I like how there's like a little bit of marble but then the legs are like this nice wooden color. The way I wanted the living space to be was like white and minimal but comfortable with a little bit of wooden accent. Sometimes I like to just have some flowers around the apartment to make the place feel a little bit fresher and give it some color. Also these like extra cushions they kind of just like make the couch a little bit more comfortable, but they're all from Target. I love Target and like their little home decor. These blankets, both of them actually are from Urban. Kobe has one of his three beds over here. He kind of just chooses where to sleep in the apartment. Over in this corner, we have the little reading nook. I don't usually sit here, but if we have guests, we can use this extra chair. This chair is from Target and the pillows are from Target as well. I have my Monstera plant over here, a little plant baby. It has grew so much. I got it a year ago and I feel like it has like five new leaves. The final part of the living room is the TV. We have a 55 inch. Samson wants it bigger. I think this is a pretty good size already. Um, the media council is from Overstock. It's nice. There's a little bit of cabinet room inside and it just, it does the job. Now we're going to move on to the balcony. I leave my bike over here. It's so cute. I feel like it's like a little decoration. And as you can see, the balcony is really big. It kind of just extends to all three rooms. This was just one we picked up from Ikea. Sometimes we like to just like have breakfast over here. We have some extra like beach towels. Kobe found a new spot to lay on. And one thing that's really nice about having a balcony in California is that we're able to just kind of lay our clothes here and dry them on this drying rack, which is just so convenient. And finally, we have this little like balcony nook, what I like to call it. It's really nice because this goes pretty far in. So we're able to just like put furniture and stuff here without it getting wet if it rains. So this is actually the bedroom, which I'll show you guys in a little bit. And I don't know if this couch is familiar for like old viewers, but this is actually from our studio apartment in New York. We moved it here and it fits perfectly on the balcony. Is that Kobe? <laughs> it's really nice that we're able to have this outdoor space. Sometimes I like to work here or just like read a book here and just get some fresh air. We also added these little fairy lights that light up at night. It's really nice. And as you can see, we have a pool in our building, which is like such a luxury amenity. And we're gonna miss it so much when we leave California. Okay, now we're gonna move on to the second bedroom, which is also my office. So this is the second bedroom. I converted it to my office slash filming room slash closet. You guys might recognize this space. Very familiar because I usually film my outfit videos here at my rack. I usually keep like the items that I'm wearing a lot on this rack or like new things that I want to style. This is my like desk. I keep some books on it. I think in our new apartment, I'm definitely going to get a bookshelf because the books are piling up. Um, but I really like this desk. It's nice and simple. The desk is from Overstock. I really like how it's like a clean wood kind of look on top with the white legs. The only thing is it doesn't have any drawers. So everything is kind of like on top and can get a little bit messy. And then as for this chair, I got this from the Facebook marketplace. I get a lot of questions on it. The brand is Ivy Bronze. If you can search it up online, um, it's like a nice little Sherpa chair, really comfortable. I don't know if it's meant for like an office space, but I think it works pretty well. This is kind of messy and Honestly, not very efficient, but I keep my jeans, like pants that I wear. And over here, we have the closet. So this is kind of where I keep my thinner jacket and my shirt and um, workout stuff. I get some questions on how I store my clothes. I'm not the best at it. I definitely need a better way of organizing it. On the other side over here, 
I have my hoodies, my sweatshirts, and my flannels, and then just like cropped shirts down here. I have a drawer here. This drawer is from Target. I don't recommend it because it was really hard to put together and the drawers aren't like super smooth. I just kind of like the wooden look. And on top, I have some just like bags and candles and my jewelry is stored in this little case. And then this little corner is just for my tripod and my ring light since I do shoot in this room a lot. Now I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the apartment starting with the guest bathroom. This is the bigger bathroom with the main bathroom. There is a lot of space in here. And this is the one that Samson usually uses. Pretty simple, clean. I wish there was like a window inside here though, just to like brighten up the space a little bit. And finally we have the bedroom. Over here we have Samson's gaming setup. He loves to game. So this is his little dedicated corner. So this is actually where the couch is, like right outside over here, and that's how everything is connected. So the bedroom it doesn't have like a opening to the balcony space. One thing that I don't love about the bedroom is the fact that it doesn't get as much natural light in here as the rest of the apartment because it does con concave in a little bit. So when we first got into the apartment, it was actually just blind and I didn't really love the look of it. I wanted it to be a little bit more like homey and cozy feeling. So we ended up getting these curtains from Ikea and it actually fits really perfectly. It falls right under the window and I think it just adds a little bit of an extra touch. This is another one of Kobe's beds and we have this little basket here for all of his toys. He has a lot of toys so he just fetches it out whenever he wants to play. And what I really like is this little doggy water fountain. I think it's so cute. One of our friends got it for us and Kobe loves to drink from it. So finally we have the bed, we got a king bed out here because we have the room for it. And um, the bedding over here is from Riley Home. It's really comfortable, so soft in the skin, and just like gives us a great sleep. And then for the mattress and the bed frame, we got both of it from Ikea. So this bed frame is called the Malm bed frame, and um, we got it with the drawers for like extra storage. This is our little nightstand. We have one on each side. Um, I believe they're from Wayfair. And this is probably one of my favorite furniture pieces. It's just like this little lamp from Urban, but it's so cute. And I love how it looks when it lights up at night. And then over here, we have the bedroom bathroom, which is also like my bathroom. This bathroom is a little bit smaller than the main bathroom, but it has a big tub, which is really nice for baths. So I didn't realize we had this vanity until like two months into living here. So everything was just like piling up at first. And then one day, for some reason, I just realized that I could open this and we have a vanity. Next to the bathroom, this is the bedroom closet. I have some things up in storage and then we do have some um, drawers and stuff over here just to like fold things and put it away. So these are obviously all mine and this little section is Samson's as well as this drawer thing. But yeah, he doesn't uh, have a lot of clothes so I do take up most of the closet space. Alright guys, so that is the apartment tour, our California, LA apartment tour. I feel like this is so long overdue. I am definitely going to miss this apartment so much. There is just so much space and the amenities are great. Um, the weather out here is obviously always great and it's just very comfortable to live here. I just can't believe it's been already a year and a half since we've been here. It feels like it was just like a month ago since 
we've moved in but really grateful for this place as for rent we got a really good covid deal and it was 26 50 i believe net effective which is pretty crazy because our new york city studio was 2500 this is our second place together so it definitely holds a very special place in our hearts and i just wanted to do this apartment tour one to show you guys and two just for memory's sake too i hope you guys like this video i'm excited for our next place thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys